Age is just a number. Especially when you're Sharon Canty and you defy it with every sit-up, every leg lift, every run, and you own every bit of your 63 years on this earth. I have the gray hair to prove it. <laughs> and the attitude to ward off the aging process. When I first started, I thought I was going to do this for three months. I thought I was going to have this young, gorgeous body, and that was going to be it. I got here working out with all these young girls, and it's like, okay, I got to do this. No excuses. It's in black and white. Anyone who enters Micah Morgan's MM Fitness Gym lives by those two words. This former University of South Florida defensive back draws from his football playing days to motivate his clients. The first uh, painting on the gym walls was no excuses. So everything was black, and the only artwork I had were those two words, no excuses. <laughs> Get them revved up, kind of like how um, our coach used to talk to us before a game or you know during practice, just to get you know get us motivated because uh, that's what it's about, you know, um, understanding what you're doing, why you're doing it, and having people that have your back and support you. Micah opened up MM Fitness in 2013, but actually got his start in personal training with a client close to his heart, his mom. She became uh, a little more overweight and was having heart problems. So I went down and I trained her for that whole uh, summer and she lost a lot of weight. And, uh, and I felt like a relief. I felt a relief and I felt uh, just a sense of accomplishment. It sparked something and provided a path to more than a career. At a very young age, Micah discovered his why. I think this is a passion of mine, helping other people physically. Um, and also mentally to let them know that they can do it, you know, they just have to have the guidance. Micah's guidance isn't just in physical fitness, mental well-being is a big focus. And just like he draws physical inspiration from his football playing days, Micah's well-versed in mental issues from first-hand experience. When I finished my career uh, playing collegiate football at USF, I felt, I felt the depression. You know, I was, I was in a hole for at least a year or two. Uh, I gained some weight, I, I, you know, I, I just w I would wake up and, and not want to get out of bed. Soon, something else awoke in Micah. I just ran for hours, just, I just ran. And afterwards, just the, just the calm and the energy I got after that run and the clarity, it just, it just told me, life is not over after football. A packed gym has proved to Micah there is life after football and he's helping others live their best lives. My accomplishment come when I'm around other people my age. Because <laughs> here I'm with the young girls and you know they can do it. But when I get around people that's my age and I see that I am walking straighter, uh, able to move stuff, lift things, that's when I realize, you know, hey, this is really working. Sharon's original three month plan turned into six years of working out. That's what Micah does. He provides a roadmap for a journey of self-discovery and overall self-fulfillment. Usually people come in here um, and they just want that, uh, that outside appearance, you understand? So the, the external tangible results, but when they get that internal, you know, intangible results, that's like the best feeling ever just because I actually change somebody's behavior patterns. I help more people every year. I get new faces every year. They, 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 they get what they get out of, out of MN Fitness and they move on and they help others. Reporting in Tampa, Katherine Smith, Spectrum Sports 360.